What's this place? I've heard of you, Outlast. must require supplies. Gates are shut. I guess I'll have to come back later. Outlander, Chief Akaro and Marshal Catalo await you within. The cool route should be starting soon. Once it's done, I'll be able to access the chamber below Hikaro's throne. And Ether. Well met, Aloy. I was hoping we'd run into each other again after the Flood and Bleeding Mark. Natika. So you did it. You're part of the Chief's Guard now. It wasn't an easy choice, but yes. After you left, we laid Kentok to rest and I thought about what he said. He served his clan, his tribe, as best as he could. I have to do the same. I'm sure he'd be proud. And he'd reprimand me for allowing myself to be distracted. <laughs> Can't have that. Thank you again, Aloy. Strike true as the ten. This must lead to the arena. It's another part of the ruins, turned into a fighting ring. Look at them all. They know a battle is coming. Regala can try all she likes. We'll crush her. I hope you're right, Marshal. Aloy, it seems you've had to move mountains to bring the Sky Clan to heal. Literally. Catalo helped. Yes. Takote reprimanded for all the clan to see. You both served well. But now the cool route is at hand. Some have come to compete, others to bear witness. They know Regala will come for me. I'll do whatever it takes to hold up my end, as long as you remember yours. So what's the plan? Catalo. There are only two viable ways to attack the arena. Through the throne room you just passed, and by the trail on the north end. We've set up barricades at both. But if Regala means to assault the cool route with machines, she will have to attack by the trail. You will join our defenders there. Hold the line, and I'll have my marshals. You will be free of my service and receive your reward. 
Make whatever preparations you must. Once the cool route begins, you must see it through. The grove, the arena, it's all part of the same ancient structure? Yes. Here the land remembers the sacrifice of the Ten. Their deeds commemorated for eternity. Sacrifice? The visions tell us that on the ground below, they gave their lives in a fight against machines. We honored them by holding the cool root where they fell. You called them peacekeepers, but the marshals I met at the embassy were warriors. Warriors, yes, but more. They renounced the clan that birthed them and pledged themselves to order and peace. They enforce my law. They settle disputes and stand for Tanakh in parlay with other tribes. Without them, I cannot rule. I know where I'll be. What about you two? I will be here with the chief, where I belong. Should the fight reach us, we will take the blood owed for our fallen. If it comes to that, the defenses will hold. Let's get this over with. Good. You'll find Decca at the North Barricade with the rest of our defenders. Strike true as the Ten. I'll see you when this is done. There's armor in that chest. Take it. It might prove useful. Your blade be bright. Good. May it keep you safe. Your hand Keep that made this happen out there. Gala means to make good on her threats. That lowlander contestant is already Let passed the blade. their blade.
The marshals shall stand Next. again. It's clear Hikaru isn't afraid of Regala, but perhaps he should be. Let Regala face our new marshals. It will take more than courage to prevail today. The cool root is sacred to the Tanakh. It must not be defined. <laughs> Let every blade. Yeah. <gasps> Honor and strength. Mr. Kote. Whatever Regala's plan, Hakaros has shown he can defeat her. Mr. Kote fixed his ego before coming here. Easterner. Didn't think the Sky Commander himself would be joining us today. If there's a chance my challengers will be facing Regala, it is only right their commander join in their fate. Or maybe you need to save face after what happened at the Bulwark. Careful now. Sometimes sharp wits bring out sharp spears. I'd save my spear for Regala's troops, if I were you. wants to prove themselves, they should do it at the hunting grounds. This will break my fall. Okay. The Karo's defenders should be at the end of this trench. And look, we are not alone in this fight. Focus on the machines. Take them down, and Regala's forces become no different from our own. Yes, Chaplain. Watch each other's backs. Dismissed. Our soldiers are ready. They will defend the cool route from below, but from above. Not bad. Where did you get it? One of our squads ripped it off a fallen machine. The honor is yours. Regala may have her tricks, but you will show her our teeth. The cool root is upon us! Our struggle demands new blood! New leaders! Release the quarry! Challengers! Approach! Take down a machine shall be named Marshall. Remember the ten. Strike from the air as they did and seize your glory.
defenses! Go!
Gregor went after Hikaru and Katala. I gotta get to them. Champion! Get to the chief! This isn't finished! I'll be back with everything I have! And all who stand with Hakaro will be run red. At attention. You fought well. Proved yourself against enemies both metal and flesh. I name you all, Marshal. Your first order is to secure the arena from any remaining rebels. Go. <sighs> I failed. I should have finished Regala. But now she'll be back with more machines. Stronger than ever. I'll do what I can to help. No, you've done enough. Far more than our bargain called for. When we first met, you spoke of your true mission on which all depends. I wasn't certain if I believed you then. But I believe in you now, so leave me. And get to your task. What will you do? Tend to the wounds. What you need is there. Take it. Your deeds today will be remembered like those of the Ten. There, that console. Come on, Aether. Time to go home. Elizabeth 
Sobek. Alpha Pony. Master override activated. Restoring ether subordinate function to original code. Got it. Now to get this back to Gaia. The visions in the grove have changed. The words of the Ten are now clear to us. Here, this must be the vision that Chief Ikaro saw years ago. All of the visions are changed, and this one just... arrived. The visions throughout the grove are different now. And this one, it, it just appeared. Is this your doing? Visions have changed. That's the one that inspired Chief Hakaro. More testimony of the old ones. Hear now the words that reunited a people. Following the tragic events of the war, Anne Faraday, the chief architect of the reconciliation effort, addressed a nation in need of hope. If we look into the future, the lens of the recent past, our fears loom. Wars waged against machines, scarcity of food and water, storms that drive us from our homes. But true courage means facing those fears with conviction instead of cynicism. Leading the peacekeeping effort with these brave men and women, these marshals of the new Southwest, has strengthened my conviction that when we are united, we can overcome any threat. Join me. Join us in that conviction. As we strive for a nation and a world without want or war. Reporting for duty, Commander. I'm coming with you. But Hikaru needs you. Because of you, he has new marshals. And a rallying cry the clans cannot ignore. So I will stand with you on your mission. Give whatever is left of my life. It is what I choose. How can I say no to that? Zo, there's someone who wants to join us. I need you to meet him in the foothills and guide him the rest of the way. Will do, Aloy. Go to the mountains, west of Plainsong. A friend of mine will meet you on the ascent. I'll join you when I can. A friend of yours? Should be interesting. Good day. All right. I need to get Ether back to Gaia. Seems like capturing it did something to the other holograms, too. Might be worth checking out.
victory buys a place in legend. I'll see you at Terminal. Have many tales from the hunting Join JTF that will land for a confirmed operation fight. deep within the rainforest, whether at home or abroad. JTF 10 Honor protected assets critical to the insurrection. Your enemy deep is in the mine. jungle, concealed by mud and darkness, they laid their traps for their enemies. Regala wants a fight. Observe the grid of JTF-10 in the mountainous regions of the hot zone. Trained to outlast, conditioned for any climate. JTF-10 were elite defenders in even the most remote mountain landscapes. The guard is ready, Aloy. We'll hold Rugala's army on this side. claimed home field advantage in the desert. JTF-10 seized key assets all across the desert. Where others feared the Mojave's raging sandstorms, JTF soldiers used them for cover, crippling enemy supply lines. Aloy. I know where my the field are relaxing at base. Admit, an Joint Task Force 10 acted as you one. No armor. Led by Colonel yep. Edward De La Hoya, their bodies and weapons were always honed for battle. How's our supply Meals, of basketball looking? Ink, bruises. We have enough to laugh. These Aloy. Aloy. Of the sky Do you all. have a moment? Blood of the Ten, Aloy. Regala denied. The truth of the visions revealed. I doubt you have enough skin to mark all your deeds. We'll just have to remember them, then. <laughs> well, thanks to you, the Chief still lives. And hope remains. But that's not why I wanted to speak with you. I need a favor. A personal one. My grandson, Kavo. He was not counted among the dead which means he must still be with Regala's remaining forces. He was taken prisoner? No. He joined them willingly. Like many young soldiers who seek to mark their skin with distinguished deeds. I must search for him. Convince him to come home. Chief Hikaru cannot spare any soldiers for this task, so my blade is alone in this. Unless you'd be willing to join me. I know it is much to ask after all you've done for us. But Kavo is the last of my blood. What made Kavo join Regala's rebellion? For some, Regala represents a chance of vengeance against the Karja. During the Red Raids, it wasn't easy to turn the clans back at Baron Light. Many wanted to pursue the Karja all the way to Meridian. So when Regala attacked the embassy, they took it as a call to arms. Yes. But others, the young especially, care only about the glory they think they'll earn by hunting an age-old enemy. And as for Kavo, it was probably a bit of both. And a youthful desire for a cause to get the blood burning. Nothing I said could stop him. You said Kavo's your last living relative? Yes. Before Chief Ikaro, the clans warred constantly with each other. Every skirmish claimed another comrade. One by one, I buried my children. 
and then their children. I'm sorry. I tried to vent my grief on the battlefield, but I never found comfort there. Only in the wisdom of the visions. And even so, I still couldn't prevent Cavo from following the trail of blood. If Cavo joined Regala's rebellion of his own accord, will Hikaru let him back into the tribe? The chief knows the value of mercy and the toll of unending bloodshed. It's the rest of the tribe I'm more concerned about. They won't quickly accept someone who betrayed them. Even with my support, it won't be easy. But you have to try. I'll help you find your grandson, if I can. Where do we start? A while back, our scouts reported Cavo's squad left one of Regala's outposts in the hills to the south. His squad never returned, but the scouts also spotted one of our own being held captive there. So we'll start at the outpost. If we free the prisoner, maybe they'll know where Cavo's squad went. Shall we head out? Let's go. Good. This way. The outpost isn't far. You know, the rebels aren't going to give up without a fight. Then we'll have to give them one. The bloodshed won't end until Regala is defeated. But what matters is the soldier they... Nikala. She's been their prisoner for some time now. She's my only lead to finding Cavo. We'll get her back. And then Cavo too. The outpost should be just ahead. You take point, I'll follow.
be close. Has to be. Oh no! Here's our hostile. This will be over soon. Get over there. Get over there. 